It's very simple. That leaves only one. And if you figured it out, I know you'll want to see it again. And if you didn't, wait till you see it again. Back with the play of the year and mystery guest in two minutes. All right, this is it. The relief for the tension. The moment we've all been waiting for. The crowning of the 1993 play of the year. Thank you. Thank all right you. Already. <laughs> all right with the drum. The best, <laughs> thank you. The best of the best. The toughest nut in the woods. Yes, it is time for the play of the year. And here it is. Washington Catholic High, Indiana playing Wood Memorial JV. Opening tip controlled by Washington. Now that's Craig Macklin. He's the cutter. Specially designed play. But where is he going to cut to? Well, don't ask the defense because the guy who's checking him can't find it. But watch the spotlight because... The guard out there, Keith Charles, does see him. He's cutting through the back, the bathroom. Charles delivers the pass. Macklin meets it upon returning from the bathroom and calmly drains the three. Well, Washington Catholic goes on to win the game 61 to 32, but who could lose after an opening like this? A landslide, folks. The infamous bathroom trick play. We're looking at it again. And it will live forever in infamy as the play of the year. I love it. Which leads us to this. We're proud to present our special guest on this special night, the chief architect, or is it plumber of the bathroom play that became the play of the year, basketball coach Kevin Riley of the Washington Catholic Cardinals joins us. Kevin, or Kevin Doyle, I'm sorry. Kevin, thanks for flying in all the way from Washington for this. How'd you get off right in the middle of the season? Well, we've had... Uh some days off here that we were able to get away, and uh, I appreciate you guys asking us to come down here. Wow, I, is the team doing well without you? Or? Uh, well, I hope they're doing better without me now. That we're <laughs> so they were probably glad to see <laughs> yeah. you go. Yeah, we haven't been playing for a while. You know, I've heard a home court advantage, but this is ridiculous. I mean, when did you dream this baby up? Oh, it happened about seven years ago. We were playing a horse game, and uh, one thing led to another. Guys were trying to make more shots and uh, uh, come up with something more outrageous than the other guy. Next thing we knew, we were running out of the bathroom, throwing up shots and throwing shots over the rafters and things <laughs> like that. So it just kept progressing. And we finally said, hey, this would be a heck of a play to, you know, throw in a game sometime. You know, it would just be funny. See yeah. if we get away with it. It was hilarious. Can we look at some video you shot yeah. around campus and around the school and stuff yeah. just to tell us about what happened? This is in the gym here, and yeah. uh, this is the route that Craig took uh, oh, yeah. going through the foyer area here. <laughs> you know, uh, going into the, oh, what like, was like, the coat room, Sort bathroom. of like helmet cam. Yeah. And then it comes ah. out on the floor for the shot. Now, how much did you practice that play? We practiced it about three or four not the times the night before for about five minutes. And, uh, you know, just worked it a couple of times, told the kids to relax and you know, have fun with it. Coach, I got to ask you, I mean, when you went on a road, I mean, everybody was out. What did they do? Lock the bathroom doors? Oh, yeah. We, we had people when we go into uh, other games, you know, say that, you know, as soon as the game starts, we'll have guards by the doors, you know, watching the restrooms and stuff. So. I know you had a big commitment that you passed up to be here. What was that um, tonight? You were, uh, weren't you supposed to be doing something back home? Well, we're supposed to be having a, a little party for the POY, you know, tonight and everything oh. back here. So, well, I, here, I have not. All of America wants to know what do you got up your sleeve next year? <laughs> well, I have no idea. We'll try to find something. How about twins or something? <laughs> yeah, maybe some twins. <laughs> Kevin, yeah. thanks for being with us. Kevin Doyle, I mean, he's got to do something That's for right. an Encore 94. I'm sure he'll come up with it. And you're your head coach there is in trouble. You're out. <laughs> anyway, that's going to do it for this year's edition of the, the umpteenth edition of the Play of the Year show. We hope you enjoyed it. I'm Fred Hill. And I'm Nick Charles. We'll do it again next year. But in the meantime, we'll be back tomorrow night. Thanks for watching. This has been a presentation of CNN Sports.